Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So near the end of September this year, I posted a video letting you know that you will soon be able to export your browsing data in Microsoft Edge, because back then in Edge Canary 119, which was then the latest preview version, there was a new option to export your browsing data um, that displays a warning when trying to export um, that said data. Now, as pointed out to me by a viewer of this channel, with the recent rollout of Edge version 118, the same feature now, export your browsing data, has now been added in Edge 118, which wasn't mentioned in the release notes and kind of flew under the radar. But I'm always grateful for uh, viewers who uh, give me their feedback when it comes to new features. So I can post it, post it and get it out there and inform the rest of you. So if we head to our history um, shortcut button, if you have that enabled, you can also obviously head to your history and activate it from your main menu. If we head to our three dotted menu, more options, Click on that. You can see now that Microsoft with Edge 118 has added a fourth option now to um, the flyout menu now for your history. And you can now export your browsing data. So if you click on that, and here's the warning I was telling you about. It says um, the browsing data you export is available only to those who have access to the exported file. This process may take a few minutes. Please wait for the exported file to download before you close the browser. So obviously this is a little bit of a warning because there is a bit of a privacy concern here um, because if somebody get, gets hold of that uh, file, um, um, that could be a bit of a privacy concern regarding your data. And then if you click on export browsing data, um, I'm not going to do it because it's going to take a bit of time, but you get the idea. That'll export that down to your local drive and then you can import that into um, another browser if you're moving on from Edge or if you are um, doing a repair on Edge. Just as an example, you've got that history backup now of your browsing data with this new feature, which I actually think is a nice move. So um, this is available now in Edge 118 and this actually rolled out with the recent update to this latest stable release. Been able to export your browsing data now in Microsoft Edge for desktop. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.